Next is type of descriptive research design. So there are various different types of descriptive survey designs. Census survey, sample survey, cross-sectional survey, longitudinal survey, comparative and evaluative survey, and documentary survey. Census survey. A census is a kind of survey where information is gathered from all the units of population, data collected through a census study in highly generalizable to the population as all or most units of the population are sampled. Sample survey involves gathering information from a small subgroup of the entire population. When selecting sample, the aim is to select a group of individuals representing the target population so that the data collected can be generalized to the larger population. Sample groups allow research to be conducted in a fast and cost-effective way. What happens in cross-sectional survey? In this type of survey, standardized data is collected from a cross-section of predetermined population at a given period of time. There are two main types of cross-sectional survey, those with a single variable and those with two or more variables. Longitudinal survey. These surveys are used in longitudinal studies where the same variables are observed over a long period of time. This allows researchers to investigate the status of variables at different points in time. There are three main types of longitudinal studies. Trend, panel, and cohort. Cohort. Comparative survey. Comparative surveys are used to compare the status of two or more variables. The variables are compared using specific criteria that must be delineated as criterion variables. Evaluative survey. An evaluative survey is generally used to evaluate a program, policy, or curriculum. It involves gathering information that can be used to rate the effectiveness and worthwhileness of a program or a policy or institution. Documentary survey. This survey involves gathering and analyzing information using pre-existing data that is already available. This data can be research papers, review articles, books, official records, etc. In documentary studies, the researcher evaluates the available literature on the research topics and hence the survey has been conducted. 